Welcome back to The Word on Long Beach, brought to you by The Long Beach Post. Ryan Kurtzman is joining me via Zoom. Now, Ryan is with Smart Cities, and he is going to tell us all the ways Long Beach is keeping up with technology and how you can submit your ideas and also about the inaugural Long Beach Augmented Reality Expedition. Ryan, thank you so much for joining us. Good to be here. Give me a little bit of background, because I know that um, Smart Cities started in 2019. What was kind of the caveat that made this come to be? Essentially in October of 2019, um, our current mayor, Robert Garcia, um, asked the city to really explore developing a smart city strategic initiative. Um, The purpose of this initiative would be to provide a really a more coordinated approach to applying advancements in new technology um, to our existing city services um, in order to improve the quality of life for folks that live work and play in Long Beach and to become more efficient um, within our operations. I know I've seen some weird things as far as technology goes. I was in Hollywood uh, last week and we ordered some Postmates and this little little itty bitty robot, our food was not delivered by a human. It was delivered by this robot. And we actually followed it because it had someone else's food in there. It was actually a pretty smart little robot. The first thing I thought when I saw that is, why don't they have one of these little robots just going around all day instead of having those once a week street cleanings? Why doesn't a little (laughs) robot just go around and pick up the trash? I know that's not technically, I probably didn't describe that right at all, but if somebody (laughs) has a basic idea like that, do they have to know? Can they just call you and say, or email you and say, hey, I have this thought? Actually, yes. Um... (laughs) One of the goals of the Smart City Initiative here in Long Beach is to allow us to explore technologies just like that robot. It's important that moving forward that we have um, some policies in place to govern new technologies like that. And that's that's what our Smart City Initiative is focused on, is making sure that those things, when they do come to Long Beach, that we're prepared for them um, and that we can sort of maximize the use to provide the most benefit to the people that live here. You know, as a city, like we are not experts. We're city government officials. We're not experts in any of those technologies. So that's why we're really putting the, the call out to the private sector to come to us with solutions that are using all of these exciting new technologies and potentially can unlock new ways of like delivering really important city services like like trash pickup or cleanup that you just mentioned. Right. I know you probably can't disclose a lot, but is there something that's in the works that you personally feel once this hits the ground, it's going to really impact people and do so immediately? Can you give us a hint as to what that might be? <laughs> I think that a lot of the projects are still to come and once the groundwork has been laid. And I mentioned it earlier, but I'm also extremely excited about the Augments of Reality Challenge. and. Um, to me, that is a perfect example of, of using technology and, and highlighting what makes Long Beach unique, uh, while also, you know, showing people the power of augmented reality and getting them excited about technology and um, getting them excited to pursue careers or pathways in science or technology or math and explore those career opportunities and hopefully some of our local schools here. The Long Beach Augmented Reality Expedition is happening in downtown Long Beach on Sunday, August 8th from 12 to 5 p.m. 